everyone welcome back to my channel today I will cook lamb souvlaki souvlaki it is a Greek food usually grilled meat served on bread and salad to cook the meat I need to marinate the meat at first here I have some oil I will use some bay leaves just crush in a hand of in the oil I am using some fresh herbs here I have oregano, bit of thyme, parsley and any other uh, herb you can hand on to. It can be fresh or dried, just use it. But traditionally Greek, the Greek cuisine, they use lots of oregano and parsley. So chop them up. All these herbs, bay leaf, I will all will go in the marinade as I will save little bit of chopped oregano here for to let her use in that food. Here I have got this one, just a bit of cracked pepper salt need to get some zest of lemon microplane grater just be careful it is very sharp and hold the grater on the chopping board so that you have good control on the grater it is just for your safety lemon zest it will increase the flavor in the food and i will just use a bit of lemon juice as well lemon juice this acid will start tenderizing the uh, protein fiber crushed garlic i have garlic cloves here just crush at first then you will see this dry skin will come off and then need to chop them up make sure when you are chopping up garlic they are really finely chopped up it may take few more minutes but allow yourself because chunky bit of garlic you do not want when you are eating your food garlic is done i will save a little bit of chopped garlic to make the yogurt sauce and here it will go in here this marinade i am making only with just different types of herbs garlic of course and oil always use some oil in your marinade oil creates a thin layer on top of meat it helps to keep the meat juice inside the pig so we don't end up really that you know dry piece of meat at the end marinade is ready now i will use a separate chopping bowl to prepare the meat i will cut the meat in dice and this dice will be not too big not really too small bit chunky so that during grilling the all the juice will not come out of the meat okay roughly size like this and they will go all in the marinade Whenever we do marinade, if you have time, allow your meat piece to stay in the marinade at least 10 minutes. If you have more time, half an hour, or if you have more time, you can put it in the fridge overnight with a glad wrap. All right, here. Yeah. Now I will 
make the marinade with all meat pieces make sure all your meat pieces getting coated with your marinade and when you will do the grilling all these small chopped garlic with oil they will be grilled as well and it will create really different flavor with all your herbs and i will let it sit for 10 minutes and in the meantime i will make the garlic sauce this is just plain greek yogurt bit of chopped parsley and garlic i said i will just mix it with this one and this garlic yogurt sauce is ready and again remember that as much we use fresh onion garlic ginger it is really healthy it uh, that fresh onion garlic ginger it boosts our immune system so depends on that how much you like to use them slowly try to increase them it is good for health the meat has been marinated long enough i mean 10 minutes now i have to thread the meat i am using bamboo skewers so it was soaked in the water for half an hour when what is threading to putting any ingredient through the skewer is called threading and be careful when you are threading hold firmly the piece of ingredient you are putting through the skewer in between fingers and pass this pointy bit through the gap of two fingers not holding or putting the finger on top then you will poke yourself and when you are threading meat make sure that all meat pieces they are staying next to each other not too much gap in between if it, there is gap what happens during grilling process meat pieces they get dry too quickly and you will end up dry piece of meat just take your time when you are threading for your safety that's all and nice and snugly each piece next to each other and put it on the tray where i will do the grilling all right i have finished threading all my skewers and all these leftover garlic pieces chopped up garlic and the herbs i will put on the meat of course they will be grilled and they will create really really fabulous flavor and of course it is healthy as well and now before i put under the grill i need to wash my hands because i have handled raw meat it is very important washing hands in between before after whenever we are handling any raw meat or poultry or fish i will put my meat under the grill now which has been preheated on high and i will cook each side three to five minutes depend on the heat of the grill and always remember when we have turned the grill on door must be open and be extra careful because all the side they are really extremely hot use a tongue for your safety to hold the tray and also another spare dry meat if in case you need to hold another thing so give this side three to five minutes when it will be a little bit brown that time i will just flip over and cook the other side all right guys here you need to have a look when you will see meat is getting this brown color that is the time carefully flip over hold the meat pieces with your tongue just straight away turn over do not turn over your meat when you are doing grilling or barbecuing again and again in that case your meat piece can lose some juice all right yeah on the second part it is cooked if you are using good cut of meat you can get it out now it will be cooked medium rare and if it is not that good quality cut of meat you need to keep it 
cook in maybe another two three minutes but do not overcook meat will be tougher i have got good steak so i will get it out now use the tongue to get it out and put it on your dish and wait for five minutes before you start serving now assembling meat has rested few minutes traditionally they use pita bread at home i have just wrap i am using wrap wrap here on a clean dry separate chopping board put some salad whatever salad you are using it is any type of mixed salad leaf like at home now i have some baby spinach so i'm using this one and line some tomatoes i have some cucumber sorry uh, capsicum just you know any type of salad ingredients good for your health and it is nutritious as well and now on top i will get the meat you can see that skewer is looking burnt it is bamboo skewer i soaked in the water for this reason it is burnt if it was not soaked under the grill it could be it could get fire so first piece just carefully use the tongue get it out and then Sorry guys, my tongue, that is too got off. Depends on how much meat you like to eat. And when you have got this part here, I have got the yogurt sauce according to your liking just use this garlic yogurt sauce it is really another traditional sauce get used in greek or in lots of greek cuisine you can serve it open as it is or you can roll it up so here is the lamb soup lucky you can have it as your main meal or just put in your lunch box the recipe will be in the description box if you have enjoyed this video please put a like and if you want to see more videos like this please subscribe see you next time bye